might chill. He might have that mic hot from before. Because how the fuck he heard all of that? <laughs> <About the ferry. laughs> he went there. Oh, right, niggas want to have jokes? All right. I got a facto show for you. I got an episode for you. It's going to be nothing. This shit going to be empty. It's just going to be audio. Yo. Are you going to put a picture of me? Oh, shit. It's just going to be audio. Yo, leave. I don't want no smoke with you tonight, man. I don't want no smoke with you tonight. No smoke. Yo. Next week, maybe. Not with it, girl. Oh, yeah. shit, babe. New so episode. Let's watch this. I didn't see this one. Uh, bro. Yeah. Nigga, app text my bro. You all right? <laughs> nigga, I don't think I answered the nigga. <laughs> Yo, I was like a kid. I was like a kid sitting on the couch the whole time like this. What I'm gonna do? And no, but she's like, sit. She's like, what Wolf is that? Mm -hmm. I'm right here. I'm like, she's looking at me like. So I didn't come. It's like four, four thirty. So four thirty, huh? Unless I was in Philly. <laughs> 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 Yeah, we good. The mic is loud. We good. We good. We good. We good. I don't care. How are you? What you talking about? Church on Sunday? Listen, I'm light skin. Don't play with church. I'm allowed to get one pass per year. One pass per year like as far as what? You allowed to fuck You allowed to fuck bitches on your girl one time a year? I'm not going to say that on live, but I get one pass per year. It's a fact though, so. I fuck up one year. Stand on business. I fuck up one time per year, and you know what I mean? You got to forgive me. I mean, so if I, you with your girl for ten years, you allowed to fuck ten bitches? Nah, I'm not. You're you're saying that. I'm not saying that. Mm, her can't pull up, Mike. <laughs> what what are you saying? saying? I'm trying to get to about what you saying. Oh, that's what is it saying? Well, no, he's talking about Queen Wolf. Like a wolf is. Grape is Grape is good. You know what? It's what I'm doing. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna bring I'm gonna I'm bring Toya up to the show. Oh, that's gonna be an episode. That's gonna be. Bad for you, boy. That's a good Definitely relationship. Won't. Yo, it's gonna be good content. Because good because we got with yeah. me and Toya. I have. <laughs> we gonna bring a lot of detective tests. That'd be fire. I, I pass everything. That's a fact. We shall we shall see. Nigga, I pass we shall everything. we shall see, sir. That'd be perfect. I promise oh, you. That episode, that episode, Av is not gonna be like, hey, <laughs> DJ Big Meek is not a man with, with not a lot of words. I'm gonna, talk, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna be talking my shit. Well, I, I can't wait. I can't wait to see. I'm gonna tune in. Be the be with it. He said, nigga, with the. Mm, I ain't gonna right? lie. Yo, we gotta bring a bubble and set too because Wolf fun. said, you know, no. Wolf said, guy, he gotta get a haircut, man. He's just outrageous. I, oh, I think it's about me. That's, oh, shit. He said, guy, you like he two months in on a fucking <laughs> island bid. <laughs> Gilligan's Island? <laughs> no, Rikers Island, nigga. <laughs> Fuck. Rikers Island. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah, my man look like the castaway? Yo, this is crazy. Yeah. Oh, man, gotta get this lotion out of my shot. It looks fucking perverted. <laughs> yeah. He got lotion in it. That looks lotion crazy. for the motion. Hey, yo, hey, yo. No why he, why would he scream that? Yo. Lotion for the oh, motion. <laughs> Speaking of lotion for... You should probably leave that alone. Because, you know, you should leave that alone. I'm just saying. Speaking yeah. of niggas that look like they in jail, look, I'm growing out my hair too. God, he just. Yeah. But, you know, you gotta have the shape up. <laughs> you to my nigga. You gotta have the shape up. It's just, like, what was you thinking? I was No, you will be on TV. Like, it's the TV right here, literally. Can we see for the show? Nah, nah. We, we, can, we can't see for is, is that nah. is that bad? Is that bad? Is that bad? Which, which like I'm like we get paid here. Why are you just thinking the shape like up? Keeping this stuff for the uh, winter. Yeah, for the winter. Look, all you gotta do, look. Leaf is a super producer. Just say your leaf. Just take him inside your leaf. I ain't gonna front, bro. Can we get a barber on set? You know what I'm saying? And then, you know, I mean, leaf will make it happen. We have barber, bartender, whatever. Yeah. We just gotta talk. We just gotta talk to leaf. We have a barber here. It's a fact. Cause Wolf said I ain't gonna lie, Gotti look like he two months into a bed on, on the island. Wolf, you said that Wolf. I said, man, just talk about it on the show. <laughs> yeah, I love Wolf. Man. I said, everybody got to do. It. Oh man, everybody got. Man, hey, look, I don't judge. I know what it is. Like, I ain't, my kids haven't had haircuts in three weeks. They want braids. Yo, it's crazy. They just my get son, shape ups. My son asked me probably like, longer. My son yeah. asked me like like four days ago, like Dad, can I can I grow my hair? Me personally, I don't care. Yeah. But I'm like, you got you got ask your mom. Whoa, whoa, whoa! That was that was rule number one. That's where you went wrong. How? 
why why if a, if a kid comes to their father, that's yeah. the end all be all. It's, you know what I'm saying? That's yeah, like but when you live together. It's like, ah, hey, got, see, nah, me, oh, listen, it's two types of men. It's one type of man that runs a house, another type of man that runs around his house. You have to decide who you are, sir. <laughs> when you say you gotta ask your mother, no, it's yeah, you gotta ask your father. Mm. Even if the mother says yeah. no and the father says yes. Like uh, what I'm saying is, hey, you got my permission. Now you gotta get your mom's consent. But now it's a standstill. It's only a two person vote. Right. And that's when me and the mom come in like, hey, look, if you wanna grow it, I think he should grow it. Now y'all have a uh, debate about right. if he should grow his hair. Exactly. It's craziness. So who gets the ultimate decision? Right. Uh, who gets the who gets the who gets the whole like like say like it's the yes. I'm vote. not gonna lie, I got I got my son out, out of a lot of shit. Get to say so, then. Eh? Mm. That shit sounds shaky. He didn't give a definitive answer. <laughs> he said, "I ain't gonna lie. I got my son out of a lot of shit." I was like, "I was like, say your girl asked you, well, where was you at the other morning when you came home at three p.m. and you like, uh, uh, we went to Philly. We had a show. What show? Is there video footage? Who you? Who else was there? You know what I'm saying? It's not definitive. It's just hey, like." Yo. He like some shit. He got quiet on that one. You know what I mean? We did round of applause for that Philly show we had. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying. All right. I'm just saying allegedly. 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 All right. Anyway, here it is. We're going to, now that we're back, we're going to, we just going to, matter of fact, we'll let uh, Queen Wolf just quarterback this one. Everybody uh, fill, on, fill on in and we'll, we'll just go from there. I've done enough. Like, welcome everybody to the Fact Though like Show. Um, That's, Gucci again. Gucci again, yeah. 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 <laughs> you gotta get it right. You gotta get it right. It's gotta actually my it. hat. If is which it, in it all in yeah, in all transparency, that's it's actually nice my hat. When did it become your hat? I like the outfit. Since I purchased it. Oh. Yeah. That's how it now usually this. becomes someone hat. It's actually my hat. And you know, but it's all good. I'm not tripping. I just wanted that I did I didn't you have on is my hat. Cap. <laughs> Literally cap. This doesn't even fit you. That's this is clearly a Jamaican man's hat. Yeah, <laughs> clearly. This, this like is a, Mr. Edmund, this is clearly yeah. a Rasta Mun hat. Yeah. It's like my me? dad's hat. Like, it could be your dad hat. If you say it's your dad hat, cool. But this is not, you know what I mean? Shout out to the shower posse. Right. No niggas that got away. Man, this lotion is just yep. perverted. It's still in my scenes. <laughs> what the fuck? I don't know, Av. <laughs> this is bad, man. Yo. <laughs> It's giving a, uh, it's giving a little room, <laughs> a little doom over there. This is crazy. A little doom. Mm -hmm. A little doom. All right, Queen, we'll take it away for all the real ones in in the in the place to be. And welcome to another week of the Facto Show. I mean, huh, damn it, those jeans look familiar too. Oh my God, can we? Can we not? Yo, you ever had a girl just go in your closet and just yes. take everything without permission? Yes. And then you just see them like, yo, is that yes. my shirt? <laughs> Yes. Oh man! All right. So now I have. I thought I was only so one. So everything I have on belongs to you now. Damn. Is this your shirt too? It's like a little brother. Is this your <laughs> shirt? I don't know. Is it? Let me let me check yeah. the receipts. I don't know. You know this is craziness. I'm I got those even. sneakers too, and I'm pretty sure I had those. Those are good pairs. Show your kicks, Queen Wolf. Those oh, yeah. that's nice. a those are good pair of Dan O'Briens. No, I don't. Okay. Those Dan O'Briens, right? But his was gold. His was gold. Yeah, those then yeah, good Dan O'Brien's. Yeah, that's fire. Thank you. With, Thank with the you. Gucci socks. Yeah. Gucci socks. Mm -hmm. Gucci everything. Yeah, yeah. I keep trolling me about my socks. So I went out and I bought new socks. And they're tall socks. Clearly yeah. the budgets have opened up again. Round of applause to the Academy. You know what I'm saying? She's spending oh, that good Josh. Yeah, spinning that good Joshua <laughs> Hammond portion. Oh, should I do the Yeah, this is we get a zoom in on him. <laughs> <laughs> Leaf, have you worn your <laughs> Gucci sneakers, Leaf? We saw we saw Leaf in his sneakers the other day. That's just, a good question. I never seen you with the yeah, Gucci's Leaf. on yet. You watch, you rock the Gucci's yet, Leaf? And can we get a bait? Can we get the beige them or the black turtle nick them? Pause. Mm -hmm. oh. Yeah, he wore it. He wore it. Yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, the, the last story. Well, I heard yeah. Leaf was about to wear it, and I heard his girl said, "Nigga, where you yeah. think you going all dressed up?" Who the fuck you get them Gucci sneakers? Oh. Yeah, who the fuck you those, nigga? Is that true? Can we get confirmation? Is that true? He said, nigga, you gotta take that shit off. Fuck you. Who, what bitch bought you that, nigga? <laughs> you no said, nigga buy, ain't no right? nigga buy oh, you no Gucci. Brand of applause and confirmation. 
A little confirmation. She said, who the fuck you that? Right. That nigga leave with a painting. Right. He called me 17 times. He said, wait. <laughs> he called everybody. Call Face out group now. chat. Wait. Wait. He, he emailed niggas. Please. Ass not picking up. <laughs> please. Yo, Dick, please tell her you bought me these shoes. Please. <laughs> Hey, yo, I said, hey, yo, what Ab, shoes what are you, you talking about, Leaf? I don't buy men's shoes. What are you talking about? <laughs> nah, I mean, I'll be your bullshit. My bad, my bad. All right. Listen. I get it from Queen Wolf. She's instigating fucking right. assault on Clubhouse. Mm. <laughs> All right. You got me. Go ahead, Godmother. Well, um, I am not the Godmother. I am the Queen. That yeah. Griselda Blanco um movie is out. You got to check that out. Yeah, so. Griselda's the Godmother. I'm the Queen. Anyway. <laughs> Um, is she so, really the godmother? Because here's the wild shit. She had people killed. She sent niggas on speaking to crash out dummy missions. She sent the nigga in the airport to kill a nigga. Facts. She sent niggas on crash out dummy missions, right? That's All true. in the name of them disrespecting her. Yep. And now here on this very show today, someone can randomly, randomly say, Griselda Blanco, fuck you, you dirty bitch. And then what? She's still disrespected. Mm-hmm. So at what point does it make sense? Well, she was making calls out from jail. Yeah, you know, it's very disrespectful. A nigga riding on a dirt bike with sandals on and his toes out, blowing her head off. That's that's disrespectful, disrespectful my nigga. That was wild. <laughs> Yo, nigga, put on shoes at least if Yo, you're gonna my shoot nigga me. Had on sandals, me. You feel me? He really had on sandals. Yeah, he had on sandals. sandals with no socks. With no socks. Wow. It's crazy and jeans. It's crazy. <laughs> Anybody, yo, if you look at all the movies jeans. in the world, anybody yeah, with he... fucking jeans and barefoot is up to no good. Yo, that's crazy. That's, a, that, that, that's all Spanish people, though. That's all Spanish people. <laughs> yeah, listen, man. Yeah, they had to be unsuspecting. Yeah, it's how the Americans. Yeah, they got to be Dominican. I really want to give it to the Dominicans, but whatever. Nah, it was, I mean, people. jeans and no socks is crazy. Well, crazy. Well, Caribbean jeans? No Come on, my boy. Like, and a gun? <laughs> was it Was you it like got, the Nike flip flops or like the Jesus sandals? Before I buy a gun. It was his, probably split toes. It was chancletas. Oh, the brown, brown thong sandals. Yeah, I go, yeah, the brown chancletas. Oh, I can't even put chancletas on them, but they were sandals. It was toes. Niggas on toes. Being on with your toes out as a but man on a dirt grip, bike is crazy. The, you could grip the pedal, you know, the little side pedal better. Big toe. And you, you know, Yo. get your toes out. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, nigga, nigga yeah you, you get on it. You Yo. got traction. They got to let me out of here, man. Yeah. This is craziness. All right, this, so anyway, um, speaking of uh, jeans and no socks, Kanye West is in the news. All right, now, nah, but we didn't do the intro. Let's roll the intro, like Swamp mm-hmm. Stories. Do all right. I'm do, do, do. I'm your co-host, Queen Wolf, mm-hmm. and I mean, round of applause for Queen Wolf. You have to point to the round of applause, or you'll never get it. I thought you were giving me the round of applause when I introduced myself. But, you well, know. I would have said we don't get paid to think shout here. Shout out to but the real ones. Josh, Josh you have to do the... Shout Josh, out to the Josh, real Josh. ones. Shout out to the chat niggas, chat queens. All you Pontius pilots, E to D. A big one. <laughs> A big one. A big and blue one. I'm happy to introduce my host, Troy Ave. Yeah, I am him. Yeah, they and they Emma. know who yeah. they know who I am. So. You know what I mean? Like, you know how to battle rap make something light, something light. Something like, light. Like, niggas, like, niggas looking like a school crossing guard today. Oh, listen, <laughs> I was going I said that, right? You look like you just came off of work. Drinking drinking a cause light. You look, you look like you just came from hating. How about that? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He was just complimenting my whole get up off camera. Now we get on camera. Look, I got the cat socks on. Like, I really do the outfit for real. Look at the bottom of the Show socks. The cat. Like, I'm really in full workout mode. Yeah. If you know, yeah. you know. You know what cat is. Yeah. Listen, I didn't say he was working 9 to 5. I just said he was working. Nothing wrong working 9 to 5. <laughs> I just said he was working. I might have been building house. If you see a forklift for some house. reason crash into the side of your house, just know he's he's directing it. Yeah, I got all the jokes today. Anyway. <laughs> they got all the jokes today. I ain't, look, I didn't say anything about this guy wrinkled shirt. At you all. told everybody I have on your hat, your shirt, I'm saying and your that, jeans, and damn near sneakers. Wrinkle shirt? Yeah, you the only one with a wrinkle shirt on here. He has a sweater. Uh, actually, I ain't there, but I had it in the back. Queen Wolf, go to GIGPS yeah. website. Is that that ain't Ralph? I ain't never seen that on the website. It's not Ralph. <laughs> you know why it's not saying. Ralph? Because got only, blue leg in the clothes. You gotta understand, like crazy. I, got I only got merch that only the DJ can have. That is mm. true. That is true. I mean, like you can't you can't get this shit on the website. You can get that it is on true. Hey, hey, me. I'm gonna tell you this now. I'm scheduling a uh, you know a DJ battle. 
So That'd be hard. To, I'm gonna need you to uh, brush up your skills. Cause and and I need the first pri- I need the the um, first place prize to be an iron, so he could get <laughs> that shirt together. You know what I'm saying? First off, Queen Wolf. I'm just when saying. When I was DJing Troy F party, All right? I definitely seen you dancing crazy, like an island yeah. girl. He say he's being offensive. He's being offended now. He's taking. I'm not being offensive. Crazy like an island girl. Listen, look. Listen, look. Island girls dance crazy. He made it seem like I was on my head top. No, no, no. Something right. Dirty in my head. Listen, it's it's easy. Wow, it's, 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 hey. easy, it's easy work. Listen, you can put me, you can put me in the front line of anybody. It's fucking not, drinking disgusting, right. by the way. Who? I mean, it's cool. What is this? Claudia, Claudia chose the lemon. Fuck drink light. Yeah, man, it's gonna I'm be like a, it's Coors gonna light. be like a, 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 like a DJ battle. Here we go. That'd be dope. That'd be dope. Though. Seriously, that's perfect because Meek is like a DJ. Yeah, like a DJ. Right. right. Like a oh, DJ. Shit. He fucks <laughs> mad bitches <laughs> and stays out to three a.m. Like a DJ. Yo. <laughs> he. Yo. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Fuck we going I'm with being this. facetious. I'm Fuck joking. Like it's a, a joke. DJ <laughs> DJ size rapper battle. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Listen, I'm just kidding. Black. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. It's a black. I'm nah, just but kidding. Hey. Oh, yeah, well, I'm planning me, this. I'm planning this. Let me get a like close a, up, Leaf. Gotta get a just close so they know I'm joking. Me. When I say crazy things like that, I'm joking. Well, I'm not because I'm not. But I just want like everyone to know this is not a safe place. If you joke on me, I will defend myself. I'm just saying. All right, true, if you true. laugh too hard at jokes about me, I will defend myself. <laughs> I will not initiate jokes with you, but whoever comes up here, is, right? Money Mike is is fair game. Yeah. He's got jokes. We got jokes. All right, let's have All jokes. Right. Is it truths? I don't do truths. What do I look like? Uh, you still want to go to war? I don't want to go to war. Listen, man. I, I don't want to go to war, but hey, look. Yo, you just stay on your side. I'm still on my side. All right, all right. You keep know like what I mean? Yeah, we keep all it like that. Uh, like Lucci and... Uh, keep it like that. Yeah, like exactly. Lucci like Lucci and Thug. Like Lucci ain't staying on the side, though. I ain't going to lie. Lu- Lucci with the shits, man. Hell yeah. Yeah, yeah. Or yeah, the well, mother. Well, Meek, I'm, I'm saying that nut, up. Right? I'm going to tell, yep. you, I'm gonna yeah, tell yeah, you about yeah. it later, what I, what I got planned for you. But yeah, we're going to do, gonna do a special episode. And hey, yo. I don't think you know about... I'm going to tell you about it later, what I got planned for you. Pause. I didn't tell What's you about this yet, but it's you're not it's, gonna pause that. You're idea. just gonna continue. You, I don't. I don't pause. I'm not gonna. Pause. So you're gonna tell this man later what you had planned for him. Yeah, right, that's is, crazy. What's like what's like not gonna be like no, what's the no details? Nipsey hustle be? situation. Hey, we don't know where it's gonna yeah. be because yeah, it wasn't paused. Look, 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 we have look. no idea what's going on. Hey, look. <laughs> oh my cuz, damn cuz. <laughs> but yeah, I got man. something. I got something special in the in the works, and so I'm gonna need you to like do some get your get your uh get your playlist ready. I tell you oh, about it later. Sure. So are we gonna do like a sound later. clash? That'd be fire. Do a sound clash. Yo, Leaf, but can we do a sound clash somehow? And like, do we gotta do a live stream so the, the music don't get monetized or, or, or like? Music? No. So how can we do that, Leaf? Oh, Gotti, you could. You could. Yo, Gotti, yo, Gotti, I, I swear to God, I play everything. I play. Listen. So basically, my plan is gonna be it's gonna be a Choya versus. Everybody, oh, essentially, oh. right? And we're gonna do part part one, part two, part three, I don't, part four. I don't need the mm. We're mm. gonna do. We're gonna do basically. We're gonna start with New York because I do feel I'm very confident in your music from in your catalog from yeah. beginning to end, and I think that your catalog could go up against, if not everybody, a lot of people in in the New York you know city area. Right. I think Round of applause why, for that. Yeah. Round of applause for that leaf. Mm-hmm. I think that's why you get a you know you get a lot of hate in the city because. A lot of people know this, but they don't want to admit it. Yeah, so what we're going to do I is... I think ball for ball, like pound for pound, ball, ball for ball. Ball for ball, pound for hands down. Oh, that's my opinion, but fact, I want to I wanna now... They ain't got a New York City Listen, that my I DJ set ready. I want to... I want to... I want to Major label versus independent. It's 10 times. I want to ask anybody. And I want to I wanna do it in a I sense... Like I want to do it in the sense that we could get a DJ, you know, we could get any, any DJ come, whoever, you know, we choose. We could put the names in the hat and choose them, whoever. And we just going to put your catalog up with theirs and we're going to let the people the <coughs> people see and, and decide. And, and see These niggas ain't on. got enough, like, real solid records. So and that's why, if we that's why we got to go. That's why we got to go part one, part two, part three, part because it's I like gonna, that idea, but. It ain't going to never stop. It's probably going to be all me. Bridging, bridging <laughs> off of what you said from. Cause I, I seen some shit. Shout out to DJ Clue, whatever, whatever. He posted from 2020 to now, like the songs. How many songs you think from 2020 to now can like bridge years later from now? Mm. I think there's so many songs in your catalog that people don't even know that you have, or people it just they they became fans of you. Later on down the right, line, right? Overlooking the catch of shit. It's oh, a way yeah. to you know pay homage to 
where you came from, your original sound, even though it hasn't changed much, but your original sound and just getting the people to understand, like, you know, where you came from. Bricks in my backpack, even before then, Chicken Spy Rock. There's so many songs there that people don't, a lot of these White new Christmas. fans don't know about One. White, White Christmas One. One. Yeah, I'm in traffic. Like we could just keep going, but a lot of these new fans, a lot of these new people who are hearing about you, don't really know where you come from and what you're really about. So, Meek, I'm enlisting you to represent the team. Right. <laughs> this is me. This is me. Uh, getting my flower. <laughs> I'm enlisting you to represent the team, and we gonna Listen, bring you know different DJs, and they gonna the represent shit. the others. You know, we ain't gonna and sing the shit. I wanna. So my my it's image is to set up you know two tables, and we got the cameras, well, we and I'm down we just with gonna go song for song. Call me on camera. We gonna I'm go song with, for song. I'm on this one. I'm down with. Yeah, whoever. we gonna keep going whoever through. We smoke. gonna keep going through. Stand Island, Bronx, we gonna let the people Manhattan, in Queens, Brooklyn. Yeah. We Listen, start with, we start with Brooklyn. Rapper, Listen, yeah, we gonna let y'all put it Listen, in the bring comments. The DJ. Put your, put your favorite, <laughs> bring the DJ. Put your favorite ROI. rapper. We tag your favorite DJ, and we gonna tag we gonna line them up. We gonna line them up and knock them down. I think That's we should it. also do ROI. So that means dollar spent based on on and dollar return. So if they spent, you feel me? If they spent a hundred thousand on an artist to make right. fucking uh, uh, ten thousand back, it cost me. Five thousand to make a hundred thousand. You feel Hell me? Yeah. So we gotta really ba- do it like that. that you, like that, you win automatically. Down. As a we gotta like, break it that's, down. That's not even. That's, that's not twenty even million a, to make this nigga battle. star, and it didn't even work. You know what I'm saying? That's not even Hold a battle. On. But I feel like you know a lot of people, they talk a lot of shit. They feel like you know they like to they like to play on your. They think you cocky and they think all this shit. At this point. We not talking no more. Well, we I, well, I am the, confident. I mean, we gonna let the listen, music. We gonna confident. let the music now speak. More money than them niggas. I am confident. Got better yeah, music yeah. Music. yeah. Just, but now, now let's we ain't gotta talk, talk about it. We gotta show it. Let's bring like a whole genre. Let's bring like a whole genre. Listen, brother. Let's let's make it. Let's make it fun and let's let's you know make it a make it a fun battle instead of just talking about what it is. Now we can show it. This is why. This is why I got all of this. It could be R and B. It could be rap. It could be. Troy Ave playlist. It could be Troy Ave versus Dipset. Troy Ave versus G Unit. Troy Ave versus whoever. Me, I'm the type. I'm not. I'm not losing. Shout out to the early mixtapes. Okay. Troy Ave versus G Unit. I'm, I'm, I'm not losing. I'm not. You mean? Wolf, this is the whole fact. I promise you, I'm not losing. You know, if you if you lose, me, I'm gonna troll you. Wolf, I can, you know I, what's crazy? I, I is that like, listen? I feel listen. like everyone's kissing my ass because they don't want me to have jokes on them now. Oh, you know no. what I'm saying? Okay, listen, is, listen, look. Seems like what it is. Look, I didn't come here. Troy, listen, listen. Av, Av is just on a, on a, he's on a whole lunch break right now. Got like a little 15 minute l- lunch break. It's cool. Yeah. Whatever. Before, All right. <laughs> so you got to do the show that. real quick. So look. Leave time, Any DJ, please. listen, tag yourselves, know what I mean? Queen Wolf is going to tap in and if, you, yes. if, if, oh if y'all feel like it got what it takes then, I mean... Yeah, just tag, just tag your favorite. We starting battle with New up. York. Me, we starting with the home, the home team. I want to battle for money, but whatever. Oh my goodness. I want money. Let's see how the first. Let's see everything. how the first. Let's see how the first battle goes, and then and then from there, you know, maybe we can monetize it and make it a fun it's thing. No it's gonna be a lot of. It's gonna be a lot of artists that's gonna want to put they put their sound it's, it's up. There's no now. competition, and you know what? So maybe they're gonna cocky, have to. They're gonna have to pay. I'm not cocky, I'm confident. Right. They're gonna have right. to, they, maybe they're gonna have to pay, but we'll figure it out. We're gonna start with the first episode, Chef and I think Fest. it's gonna be fun. Chef Fest, February. I think 25th. it's gonna be exciting. Oh, Shout I'm gonna out set to that Chef up. Fest. We gonna do that. We gonna have a. We gonna have. We gonna bring a sound clash. I never seen one in California. I think. I believe we're I'm gonna have a sound clash in California. That's gonna be fire. Let's do that. Let's All right, can we that. shoot the commercial? Um, you want to shoot the commercial? And come right back with some, come right back, some, back topics. with some topics. I will right. be right back. This is the fact. Those show. Break. What? Yeah, he's on oh, break. Yeah, right. break. I've got to go back to work. I'm not even here right now. I'm bright as shit, but I'm not here. Like I'm literally in neon safety green. I've got to go back. I've got to go back to um. Damn, Leaf, I can't get on camera time. And you gotta. Not me. I gotta go to Newark Airport. <laughs> Talk that me? shit. Whatever. Yeah. But we're gonna so go to yes, we'll break. be we'll be right back. We gonna get into some topics and we gonna pop more shit. You know, kick it. You gotta go back to India all with that, that shit. fake ass GIGPS shirt you wearing. So you know leave. Run us off with thirty. We'll be right back. That shit is not. The fact the show. Where that shirt from? That shirt is not on website. I made it myself. Exactly. What does GIGPS mean to me? I mean, God is getting the paper straight. You feel me? Like, I'm super blessed. I'm blessed with good health, good energy that I give and receive. And that just comes from me really being a genuinely good person. It's like the love outweighs any negativity that may come my way. And that's how I'm able to go through so much and come out stronger every time. You feel me? 
I pray a lot, not just only for myself, but for others. And with that in mind, I design these clothes. Really thinking about peace and comfortability, cause that's really two of the main things that I personally want out of life. I'm here to motivate, spread love, and destroy hate. I'm Troy Ave. God is great and the paper straight. God is great, paper straight. Go ahead and smile. It don't matter if they hate. Go ahead and smile. You the one, no debate. Go ahead and keep smile. Keep it real, fuck whoever, keep it fake. Go ahead and smile. In the mirror, you in love. Go ahead and this smile. This your song, one ahead in the club. Go ahead and smile. Everything is on fleet. <laughs> Cause yeah, Mike is. Hold this. The fuck? He did bring the cakes. Pause. She said, hold this like he was in a. Walk around the bay, your whole list <laughs> neighborhood. Right. Right. We, right. Are, we, are we back? Are we back, Lee? <laughs> are we? We back? And, Flirt with and this guy all fucking day. And we're back. I think hold this, man. Hey, take put my number in your for phone. Somebody, it's open. For somebody on break, you Com just... Oh, no, I'm back. Talking a lot. I'm back in full. I didn't put on this shit to be on break. It's, you know what I'm saying? I'm just saying, compliment this guy fucking bald head and pass him a phone. There's no fraternizing here at the facto show. Damn it. I'm just talking shit out. Right. Well, All right, we're let's get into some topics. I got. Are one. they hot topics like Wendy Williams? <laughs> Free Wendy hot Williams. Um, Free Wendy Williams. Word up. Free Wendy so, Williams. So, uh, Keisha K. R. This is Gucci. Gucci Mane's wife was just in the uh, blogs recently um, because Tia Kemp, which is Rick Ross's baby mother, she said that. Well, she alleged that mm -mm. Uh, Keisha K. R. was sleeping with uh, Rick Ross while Gucci Mane was in jail. Yeah. So she shut those rumors down. We will say we will Rick Ross's baby mother <clears throat> said that Keisha Keo was sleeping with Gucci Man. I mean with Rick Ross. I mean so they were, Ross Why would she do that? That's so messy. Why would she Why would she uh, expose it or why would she is, sleep man. with Gucci Man? I mean why <laughs> would she sleep with Rick so Ross? Legit. Why would she why would she first of all, I think Gucci Man is one of the probably best artists to ever come out of Atlanta. For sure. I'm just saying, as far as like from what I think, hard working, standing on, I hate to say stand on business, but like, you know what I'm saying? When I had wars against him when he was outnumbered, like I look at shit like that. You know, like a whole lot of shit and came out on top. Yep. Went crazy. I like artists that don't stand with people. He, remember he had the, the tweet rant where he went crazy on everybody? Yeah, he mm -hmm. Remember saying threw Nicki fuck? Minaj out the car, the moving car? Yeah, that's a fact. That I mean, crazy. This is Gucci bird. This is fat Gucci. Black lips at the Gucci. belly. Yeah, yeah, fat Gucci. Yeah. So it'd be no Gucci man slander. No, there's and no slander. I yeah. mean, this it's fucking uh uh this woman is coming out of left field. Sounds like a bitter baby mother. Yeah, she's exposing a lot of Rick Ross's uh business these, these past couple of days. All these exposes people always got, shut it down. Nobody ever exposes a broke nigga. It's always exposes unless we talk about Poppy. But Poppy <laughs> got money now, right? Did he pay you that money back? Uh, no, but was Gotti. He called you the other day with a money phone. He called him on a regular phone, a Metro yeah. PCS, and a money phone with about, was it, ten, fifteen thousand dollars in his hand? Yeah. Say, yo, I got money now. And then he asked you what? What did he ask you? Did, did he call you about the episode? Nah. What, what he asked you? Did he say, do you have Cash App? Do you have Zelle? Like yeah. normal people? What, what did he ask you? What form of payment did he ask you would you like to receive? Yo. I'm going to keep it real. He didn't even ask me about the cash. He just said, yo, son, I bought mad shit, son. <laughs> he said he bought, bought mad, mad shit. shit. Why he owe you money? Yeah. Oh, God, he thinks you're pussy. <laughs> Round of applause for that nigga. That's crazy. He holding it, your money. He said, yo, I got you. He said, yo, I got you, my nigga. I just got to pay you bills, my nigga. I got you, my nigga. <laughs> what? I got to pay these bills. It's crazy. What bills? Nike, Jordan, <laughs> fucking Prada, Gucci wow. shit he liked to buy. What bills? I didn't know they had monthly bills. That's crazy. Uh, he is a firm or afterpay. <laughs> Nevertheless. All right. So Keisha K. R. she wrote back. She said, ain't never had no dealings with Rick Ross, period. Keep my motherfucking name out y'all mix up. Yeah. Ross and my husband are friends. What the fuck? How dare y'all? Bitches is pressed and mad. Medication needed. Well, you know what? Let's she Google. Shut that was, down. Let's Google to be fair. Was, um... Keisha Keogh in any Rick Ross videos? Yeah, she was. Oh, wait. Photos. 
Or she something. was. She was in a couple ways. She said she, there Chuck. was a photo and the caption was, "Yeah, me and Rick Ross about to tear Miami up or something yeah, like she that." She was in a couple videos with Rose. Hey. Yeah. Yeah. And she was, and I'm not gonna lie, she was in Yo Gotti videos too. So, you know, Yo Gotti already confirmed he 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 he, he hit it. So, Yo Gotti, cause I don't know Yo Gotti to be a liar. I ain't gonna hold you. I don't. Uh, 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 that nigga don't be lying. <laughs> well, I mean, somebody had her before Gucci, so we can't really no. judge. Hey, what you said, she belonged to the game. I can't say, she I can't say a man's game, wife belongs to the game. Say. That's crazy. <laughs> that is crazy. <laughs> That's kind of crazy. I went, I went, and then she, the fact that she held him down while he was in jail, I think he said he gave her the last whatever money he had and she flipped it multiple she times. It. She, she a real one. Yeah, she but let's, let's, one. let's get back to the facts though. I know often when women are in rappers' videos, yeah. R and B singers, yeah. maybe even rock and roll guys, yep. they often having sex with them. Oh yeah, it's a thing. It's a thing. It's, it's going down. Right, it's a thing in the world. It's going down of entertainment. Shoes, man. But maybe she was. How many videos? If it was one video, then maybe she it's a like, one she off. Like three, she in like three, four. She was in. All I do is win with them. Oh, see, God, this is why I fuck with. This is why I fuck with guy. He's a historian. He got names and shit. All I do is win. What else? Yeah, she was in. She was in um Rose Mafia music too. And I think she was in another one with um with him and Yo Gotti. She was in a video. Both of them. Him. Oh yeah, both shit. Of them. Yeah, she was in the video. See now, I, I know women that have been in videos and not had did anything with the artist, but it's usually like a one off. And then it's there's so one-off. many girls, the artists can't really get to them sometimes. Yeah. But with multiple videos. I don't know that. Like, that wouldn't slip through my cracks. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying. And I don't pay like I weigh like these niggas do. You feel me? But if, you know, did did Rick Ross come out and deny this like a real nigga? No. He ain't say nothing. He didn't speak on it. So. Why didn't he deny it? (laughs) Why didn't he say fuck out of his bitches bugging? (laughs) Right? Ain't that the thing to do? Being uh, silent yeah, speaks. I mean, I'm saying if she came out, and at least a, what I would have did, I would have at least did a, a, a retweet or something. If she felt at the least. need to address it. Thank yeah. you. You know when a woman started. I mean, he should have just retweeted it, like yeah. or liked it, like facts or some yeah. shit like that. You know what I'm saying? But you know, you can't no. tell niggas what to do with well, women that they allegedly may or may not have been with. I don't know. It's, you know what I mean? It's just crazy. On to the next episode, because Gucci Man is one of my favorite artists, and you know. But I ain't gonna lie. I want to be a baby, little bit biased here. But I ain't gonna lie though. The baby mama shouldn't even be talking because she was in a whole video with Fifty. That's wild. Come on, son. She was in a and whole 50's video. Fifty's a savage dog. Fifty took yo. Fifty took the nigga kids to Floyd House with Puff did. Son. Did he? I yes, remember that, nigga. but Ross got so many kids. I didn't know which kids it was. He took it. Yo, <clears> he took the kids to Floyd House with Fifty. Come on, my nigga. So you already know we don't believe nothing she's saying. If you was did, they go on the rides and all that. Like in all the, that. Wow. All that. <laughs> did they see the car collection? All that. Took pictures by the cars. Took pictures with Floyd. Took pictures with Puff. You signed boxing gloves? Come on. Yes. Oh, uh, no, nah, that's crazy. Come on. He signed man. boxing gloves. I mean, come on, that's crazy. They had dudes. Leaf, I need to take a hit of that bung, Leaf. Let me get some of that smoke. Pause. Sit, pause. Yeah. Yeah. The, the second one got the sex tape. Hey, speaking of hitting that bong, um, did y'all see uh, Wiz Khalifa blowing smoke in uh, AD's mouth while he was asleep? Oh, that's crazy. The, the AD from that's the um, AD from No Jumper. Yeah, I think Yo, he left No Jumper. He got he the other no shit jumper. now. He got a Wait, shit. that that's he was that's his... with his head back. Like nah, this. that's different. I that didn't know. Different. I didn't know that was him. I just thought Wiz was doing some nah, mook that, shit. That's different. And Wiz son. was giving him contact. No ass. That's like, different. Nigga, I seen it. I was like, what the fuck type of weirdo shit? But Wiz be having his toes painted and he be yeah. on wild shit. So I'm like, all right, maybe yeah. he's just doing some wild fun. But I didn't know that was AD. I, mm-hmm. so AD I, that was wild. That, and, and so, hey, so wait, wait, hold on, hold on. So what happened? They didn't squabble after eyes. that or he didn't no, slap the shit out of Wiz? They, it was funny. It's not funny about that nigga blowing, contacting, gave him a shotgun. It was funny. He gave him a shotgun. I don't have what? no friends blowing no shit in my... Nah, blowing smoke? Nigga, that'll be the end of our friendship. We do that with, we do that with females. We don't do you that feel with me? niggas. I ain't never do that with no females. He recorded it. 
It's I, recorded. That reminds me of yeah, but that, but 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 AD supposed to be a real. No. supposed to be a real dude. No, Weezy and Birdman either. Ah, right, come on. Mm, that was more father son. This is more like you, my homie. I'm gonna blow they blow weed the, out they of your mouth. On the mouth. These two, bad. these two didn't touch lips. He it was still, still we. It was smoke out. from your mouth. Come it on. was mad close. That's you know, crazy. You know, woman blow smoke in your mouth though, like a shoddy, it means you want to fuck, doesn't what? it? What? Oh. With a guy? With the you, no, you blow no, no. blow shy by yourself or with a guy? I do that with females. No, no, no. How how far are you? Because he was as close as his mic, and and the guy was the guy was sleep. Like yeah, this, I don't I'm know not, if he had his I'm mouth open. He leaned over him and blew smoke yeah, in his I'm mouth. Not doing, I'm not That's doing what they were saying. They saying that it was it was out of. It's not funny. Hey, yo, hey, yo, we doing what, that in what? Brooklyn, son? Nah, we nah, nigga, nah. we not doing that. No, we not doing that on the <laughs> island. We not doing that nowhere. <laughs> that's not funny. Yeah, <laughs> that's like we getting it pop as soon as you start doing that. Yeah, Wiz could be weird. I got a homeboy named but Tali Yahweh. He's like kind of like on some Wiz shit. I like, yeah, but 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 I don't play any of that funny shit, nigga. Like, smoking a nigga mouth. fuck is you doing? I went, we going to SCK. Tyler tried to do some, grab my chest. What the fuck is you doing? I'm from from Brooklyn, Playboy. Like, like nigga playing like... Yeah, like some shit. Oh yeah, like <laughs> Tyler created type shit. Yeah, but Tyler, y'all yeah, the f- yeah. said, "Fuck is you doing?" <laughs> like I get serious. I go from play fighting to real fighting real quick. Yeah. I get serious real quick. Like I know you play like that, but boundaries. You gotta be like, let's have boundaries here. Huh? Don't blow no smoke. Don't blow. Like, who fucks with me when I'm asleep? You know what well, I mean? Well, like, I'm not sleeping no with problem. my neck back and my mouth open. I'd rather you draw a dick on my head than blow smoke in my mouth. That's more acceptable. That's weird. Like, all right, that was funny. Uh, yeah, it's fucked up, but it's funny. Yeah. We still going to fight over that's it, but crazy. don't put nothing from your mouth in my mouth. Pause. And yeah, your head back? Hey, you ate Natalie Nunn's pussy. I don't know he wants that in his mouth. That's wild. Who ate Residue. Natalie Nunn's pussy? Well, allegedly, Wiz was fucking with Natalie Nunn. Yeah. Wow. Uh, the girl from Bad Girls Club. Iron Chin from Bad Girls Club. Iron Chin, that's Iron crazy. Chin. Call Iron Chin. <laughs> ah. That's crazy. That was wild, Gotti. Ah. That was wild. That's crazy. Iron Chin is... I'm going to... You got to drop this. got to drop this. got to drop this. Iron Chin is wild. Wait a minute. Have you ever taken the... Uh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, pal. Pal is here, everyone. Have we shot every... Did we did a... Uh, uh, um, what is it called? Did we do introductions? No. We haven't, right? No. The fuck? She didn't, alright. Well, nice of you to join us here. Yeah, um, you're back for the second episode. Can I ask why you have your glasses on your head and not on your eyes? Do you I need them, them to see or are you just trying to... No, I need them for far away. So, like, how many fingers? Three. Okay. So, can you see what Leaf is thinking? No. See, that was a trick question. I wonder where this turtleneck is high in here. <laughs> we got to put the camera on him. We got to put the camera on him. Yeah. Oh, man. Hey, and yo, on yo, Leaf been wearing this turtleneck for two weeks. He's thinking he's, <laughs> once the actors went on strike and shit, he just he took over everything. You know what I'm saying? This guy was heavy on the YouTube. He said, yo, what can I do to make the show better? Not nah, Leaf, I appreciate it, man. Like. Hey, I appreciate you. Like, Leaf motivates us and shit. You know what I'm saying? He gives me little pointers and shit. And he says, yo, listen. That's a super if, producer. Right. If I'm going to give you guys orders, I'm going to have to look the part. So he puts on his tight-ass turtleneck and the fucking smoke that he's fucking smoke coming out of his neck. <laughs> Every time he hit the bong, <laughs> you see this shit pulsating, pause. <laughs> but, but Leaf is our guy. It's okay. Yeah. He's wearing all black. And he's chilling, you know what I'm saying? He gonna get home his girl and say, I told you not to wear that fucking turtleneck, nigga. Oh, hell yeah. I told you not to wear that shit. Hell yeah. Fuck wrong with you. It's not even hot out today. You know, that's why I got a jacket and not a fur on. It's not even hot. All right. Nevertheless. Okay. So, pal, why do they call you pal? That's my last name. Is it just P-A-L? It's just pal, yeah. Like Police Athletic League? Whoa. Because I know you uh, have a lot of dealings in the streets, so well, the people scared to deal with you because your initials say Police Athletic League? Is it like, whoa, let's not buy heroin from her because whoa. it might be the Police Athletic League? Yeah. 
That, yeah, people, I mean, like, obviously, back in the day, I had beef and stuff, and, like, there was never no police shit. Oh, yeah, can, yeah, can you put the mic towards you? never no, like, police shit. Yeah, because when, when we talk about beef, we went to... Oh. Here we go. All right, all right. What kind of beef? Was it like a... Was it like... I think what you're referring to is, is the time I told you about... Um, so, I thought I was cute. Back in the day, right? Leaf, and give like, me a shot. Leaf, I, post. I had, I was, I was selling successfully for. Leaf, a long give me the time. camera. Leaf, oh, and wow. uh, a couple of different things. Okay. Uh, and uh, what happened was I got robbed in broad daylight. Actually, you know, so like that was my sign, kind of like, yo, you gotta stop this shit. Yeah. I got pistol with like right across my forehead, like an idiot. Oh shit. Yeah, yeah, but the good. Where's this at? What, what, na- what neighborhood is this? I had, the, yeah, I had so my we... drugs and my money in my glove yeah. compartment, right? And wait, like wait. the kid had known about that because he was banging my cousin. Wait, wait, so right. anyway, wait. in Coney Island, Coney actually. Island. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. oh, oh Jesus, but shuttle there's, there's a camera yeah. right there. My dog Bassie Telfair in them. Yeah, 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 yeah up there. So, Coney yeah, yeah, Lance Stevenson and all that. Yeah. I feel like. It wasn't that bad of a situation because at the end of the day, they didn't get my shit. They didn't get my money. They didn't get my drugs. They took yeah, my, sh- my diaper bag. Like, oh, how right. did they take a diaper bag? Yeah. yeah. Cool, yeah. I hope you had a dirty diaper in that shit, too, or some <laughs> shit. Like, a couple pampers. Pampers wasn't even expensive back in the days. Nah, you feel nah, me? Nah. You Matter of fact, getting incredible diapers. My man, Wack 100, all Shout you single moms man. that need diapers, you know, hit us up. We'll Come take care of you. Hood selling right. Diapers. Especially for Valentine's Day. We'll take care of you. We'll send you a package. Don't worry about it. But yeah, okay. So they took a diaper bag. They didn't get the drugs or the money. No. So I was like, all right, whatever. Yeah. It is what it is. I took that out. Like, I wanted to run around thinking I was, you know, palling yeah. around. Like, yeah. I'm a tough around. guy and shit. Round you know, of applause. Was that was a good one. Palling around. Because, like, back then and shit, like, you know, I've, I had a couple fights under my belt. Like, you yeah. know, I, I beat girls. Because everyone thinks, like, because I'm tiny, I can't hold my own. You're right. So it's like, at that point, I'm like that Napoleon complex. I got something mm. to prove or something. And, like, you could ask about me. You could do your homework at the end of the day. Like... I got ratted out like three times. No. Bro, there's this fat girl fucking... Oh, she's not like... Hey, Sam, we, you know, we can speak. There's this girl, Sam, I'm beating her up. And like, while I'm hitting her, I'm like... Sam, you fat bitch. You, right. you fat... fat <laughs> Sam, you I, fat rat. My thumb put like her Sam, mouth, the fat rat. And she's biting my thumb. So like, oh. as we're fighting, I'm like, yo, I'll get you a cheese, but get off my... Get off my hand. I'll like, get you a cheeseburger. She got it's my crazy. thumb in her mouth and shit. And then she ran to the precinct because this happened on my, my girl's ex block. My ex girl's block. This is in right. Coney Island. Too? Oh, no, this was on Bay 16th, and oh, she ran. I know Bay 16. I do my taxes around there. Oh yeah, I know. Yeah, she ran to the 62nd precinct after that, a couple blocks away, and yeah. said she got jumped. The uh, six two, not to yeah. be confused with the seven. Yeah, she's three times two. my size. Like, yeah. what were you embarrassed that you had to lie on me and say you got jumped? So then, boom, you know, detectives come knocking at my door. I get yeah. arrested. They locked the you up for that. Thing. I was like, yeah, I got. She pressed charges. Like, wow. Yeah. I call it like six two ain't no joke. My man's got locked up in six two. Yeah, ain't no joke. No, the worst part is if you yeah. get arrested between the jurisdiction of two yeah. precincts. I got arrested between like 69th Street and 14th Avenue. So it's the six yeah. eight and the six two. It was That's my so first sorry. case ever. It was Supreme Court. I was so tight. Yeah. It was robbery and assault. Cause you know, I thought yeah. I was slick and I was robbing iPhones for a while and shit. Oh yeah. yeah and me and this girl took yeah, a phone yeah, off yeah, the train. Yeah. yeah. And what uh, you mean? the you lady take, ends up, you take it right out of my hand because I remember yeah, we used to do a lot of hand. shit with somebody yeah. talking door about the yeah, clothes. Take that shit so, quick. Yeah, <laughs> so that, week before, I fucked up. That's terrible. I did. I seen that shit. Times. Oh man. The week before, you know, we're on the train and me and my best friend were like, I was like, you won't do it. You it's won't a criminal do it. She did it and I had her follow ups. You know, like yeah. bing, bang, boom, whatever. So the next week, she was like, you won't do it. You won't do it. So I did it. She hits this lady and we're running out 62nd Street by the D train. We were on the end. And the lady ends up being like a track star or something, bro. She's oh, chasing she us. Chase so blo- chasing oh, don't you us. hate that? Chasing I had some shit like that yeah. where they chased us, oh, and I'm like, yeah. we had and to send shots fell. back on Coney Island yeah. Avenue. Wow. Coney Island Avenue, right? Or the mother. Yes. We had, it was supposed. It was like not to cut you off. We I was we was like kids. We was like 16 and shit. And we go. This is like every day. Thank God. I'm like really thank God. We are not in jail a day. Every day was bullshit. Like, yeah. like streets is a myth shit. You chilling in the house. It's like if we all chill right now. Yeah, and, I got arrested on and, Coney Island. And a random friend comes in. Hey, yo, I got a lick. Yo, I got yeah. a jux. I got a jux. That's what we used to call it, a jux. Yo, I got a jux. There's no homework done on it. There's no uh, months or weeks or even days of surveillance. Yo, I got a jux. Word what it's about. Hey, yo, it's a jewelry store, but it's really a, a, a spot downstairs. And they got, oh, all right, boom, let's do it. And you just go just like that. We got gun, gun, gun. Everybody got gun. We out. And so 
Won't stay long. We end up going in there, doing some shit, and this fucking this guy would just he would just not get down. So I ended up, get the fuck down. Fuck, cause you're not going in there to do no killings or anything. Hell no. It's dumb. We gonna get some jewelry and some drugs they got downstairs. So he beating him, beating him, he finally gets down. Uh we take whatever we got. They then it was like bullshit drugs. It was like it was like coke and little aluminum foils. Little small ones, a bunch of ten dollars of coke, yeah. and whatever bullshit jewelry was a fake pawn shop. It was a pawn shop. We took a bunch of shit. We go running out like this, mind you. Like, I, man, if my kids ever did shit like this, I would be fucking devastated. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, it was the parental guidance. I don't know, yeah. but anyway, um, you gotta stay on top of your kids, your younger siblings, all that kind of shit, cause they get caught up by the grace of God. I'm here, mind you. We're on. We're on, um, I think I'm on Argyle Road. Oh, I know over there. Where this jux comes yeah. to play. I'm on Argyle Road where this jux comes in. When he walks in the apartment, yo, blah, 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 blah. Oh, word, we got, oh, word, there's no homework. Yeah, let's go do it. Grab a couple guns. We walk. There's no cars. We don't have cars. We have bicycles and then we're on foot. Hell yeah. We walk four blocks. We walk to um, Westminster, uh, Stratford, another block, and then Coney Island Avenue. And we go to rob the store, four blocks. Go in there, the guy's not getting down, start hitting him, the fuck down. Like, let him know you mean business. There's certain things you do in robberies. I would never rob nobody, but back in the day, when kids, we didn't, that's not did all the robberies as a kid. Listen, all of us, listen, I'm gonna keep it real. And it's sad though, it it's shouldn't sad. happen, bro. It's it's sad, Somebody should be like, no, this is how you get some money. Yeah. Not no, no robberies, because that's gonna be short money that you're getting and it's over. You got It is. Like, it is because you getting only bullshit money. It, I done did it's like picking tomatoes. Like, show me yeah. how to plant the shit. Hell yeah. I done did a couple B and E's. My man, my man's did a B and E. And he only got five hundred dollars. <laughs> he went in the crib. Womp, 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 womp. Womp. And I'm gonna keep it real. He stole he stole the dudes ain't wanna sell it. We went to the store, we tried to sell the computer, the iPhone, and all that. Yeah. The nigga took an iPhone, he took a Mac wow. and all that. We went in the crib. Niggas went in the crib. Niggas ain't even know we went in the crib. My man's went in the crib. We told him we was lookout for him. So we told him, go in the crib. The lookout. <laughs> look out's crazy. We told him straight up. Listen, you go in there because dude, that's what he do. That's his profession. Cat burglar. Straight up, go in the crib and all that. That's crazy. Dude, case, we already knew the crib because we've been inside the crib before. Oh, y'all was robbing the cat burglar. We No, we went. The nigga crib that we went in was a weed dealer. Okay. We've been inside the crib before. You know what? And and to say, like, I'm going to get back to my story, but to say, yeah. like, I always, even from then, I always try to have some type of integrity. Yeah. So we only robbed other people that was in the streets. That's a fact. Or or we we had robbed, um, shout out to my man Chino. Uh, we robbed <laughs> we robbed these older dudes that was fucking with these young girls. It was my man's sister. Like, why do you fuck with these young bitches? The fuck? We robbed them because yeah. they shouldn't have been doing that. It's petty shit, you know what I'm saying? Like literally. But go, go ahead. But yeah, so when dude went in there, niggas like, yo, we gonna go to the store, we're gonna try to sell this shit. And niggas like, yo, it's hot. We can't get the cold. I ain't gonna lie. Niggas went to Brighton Beach. Mm -hmm. Dude sold it. They was like, all right, y'all got the iPhones, y'all got the computers. Boom. Mm, how much they gave y'all? So son gave homie 500 For iPhones and the computer? No, no, no. For the iPhone. He didn't take the computer. His man took the computer, and he. My man said, "Yo, I want a thousand. He told him, "Nah, I will give you eight hundred for the computer." He said, "All right, I'll take it." That's still kind of good. That's good. He gave. Was it a MacBook? MacBook. He said, "Yo, a I'll pro give you or Air?" It was a pro. Mm. He said, "Yo, I give you eight hundred. This what I could do for you." My man, the man said, "Yo, I sell a phone to your man for five hundred. Cool." So, dude got mad that we took the money. I said, yo, son, we, listen, man. We told you to go in the house, bro. We're going to give you this weed here, and we're going to take that money. <laughs> you want the weed? We're going to take the money, bro. Streets is a myth. It's honor amongst what thieves. what it is, my nigga. We, you went in the house, nigga. We ain't going in the house. We just sat there and wait for you to come out mm -hmm. with the shit, my nigga. Mm -hmm. It's what it is, bro. So for the B&E, how much money you think y'all split? I just want to give the people... Like uh uh, I split two hundred with my man. My <laughs> man split the two hundred. Yo, did that. could have went to jail for week. like a couple years for that bullshit. Yeah, but listen, listen, Ed. Statue of limitations, my nigga. No, no, no. <laughs> yeah, not now. 
At the time when you doing shit, at the time, sometimes it's not always good to live in the moment. Hey yo, what up, y'all? This your boy Troy Ev, and the new White Christmas is here. This one is a special collector's edition, number 11. They trying to lock me in jail, so we might not get one for a long time. But as always, you know I deliver. I need y'all to go buy it off iTunes to support the real independence. But if you spent all your bread and you gotta stream it, do me a favor. Send this to 11 people to commemorate this classic 11th edition of White Christmas. It's out now, so do not wait. God is great, and the paper's straight. Powder. It ain't always good to look. You got to step out of the moment and really look because yeah. so boom. Whenever niggas say so boom, they about to tell you a good story. So boom. We do. I'm, I'm, in, I'm in the jury store. It's four of us, mind you. It's supposed to be a big, a bunch of drugs in this in a spot that was yeah. that was uh, made to look like a fucking um, a jury store. Yeah. Cool, little pawn shit. We take the little bullshit jury, take the money in the register, and there's, there's no drugs. It's bullshit drugs. It's literally a bunch of, like, <laughs> little coke and tins. They could have been using it. If they got caught with this shit, they could have got off. What they call it, shit, Michael, you get caught with the drugs, you be like, yeah, I'm using it. Paraphernalia? Yeah, just possession. It's not no intent. We take this shit, and finally, right, let's get the fuck out of here. I think one of us had a bike, a, a, like bicycle, a bicycle. Others, we run around. We run around in Stratford. Stratford is one or two blocks. Stratford is two blocks from Coney Island. Now, mind you, I said we walked four blocks. We started here. We walked Westminster. We came from Argyle, walked to Westminster, whatever this block is. Stratford, whatever this block is, I think it might be East 10th, and then Coney Island Avenue. Yep. We leave out the store, we run back on Church Avenue, we running up. One of the motherfuckers from the store start chasing behind us and yell, Yo, yo, hey, sell him, yelling, yo, yo, he yeah. took it out. I know how that shit Now we is. hot? What time yeah. of day was this? Oh, it's broad day afternoon. No. It's, it's <laughs> middle of afternoon. It's not much thought put into this is, caper. We just. You know, now, mind you, it ain't no my song taxi robbing shit. Nah, nah. This is on a level of shit. This is like the earth to the sun. This is like this big See, difference. Niggas, niggas don't rob civilians. That's a fact. They rob dudes that's in the street. So now in my mind, I'm like, how the fuck are they chasing us? And they really had some drugs. Now, my, we didn't know it was drugs. We just took the aluminum foils. Like, how they really chasing us? So now we hot as fuck. So fuck that little shot. Boom, boom. Just to get them off. I'm not trying to hit them. I don't want this to turn into a fucking homicide. It's yeah. Trying to give me some fucking money to smoke weed with my homies and buy new Jordans and shit. Hell yeah. So now, so the guy's leaving, but now the shots go off, the police is there. When I tell you, I spent, this happened like at 3, 4 o'clock p.m. I was in a fucking laundry room. I was in a laundry room closet. Then I made my way, and we got into a building, I hid in the laundry room closet, then made my way into a staircase until 11 p.m. that night. Police were scouring the block. Took my clothes off, put them in the fucking dryer, like whatever. You know what I'm saying? That's how you do. Nigga. And like, I remember thinking, oh, God, don't let me get caught for this shit, man. Oh, my gosh. This is dumb. Like, I remember thinking, like, yo, if I get caught, my mom's going to beat my ass for some just dumb (laughs) shit. You know what I'm saying? And by the grace of God, I didn't get caught. No felony. Still had to, had the gun on me, everything. Like, and didn't get caught. But I say that to say, like, there's a lot of dumb shit that might seem like it's big and important at the moment, but it's really nothing. It's, it's how it you ain't move, about though, shit. Ab. It's how you move, though. Man, I'm not trying to move about them. They couldn't have, even if it was, yeah. it's four of us. Even if we was robbed, and then the guy who put us on to the robbery. Yeah. How much we getting? If they had $5,000 in this spot, yeah, it ain't nothing. Nothing, really. We get more than that for talking shit. Hell yeah. You know what I'm saying? All right. Enough of that. Before we act, because I want to get into some more topics. I don't know how we got there from there. It was something you were, about... You were asking how, how she got here. Oh, yeah. We talking about... You said 15? That was 50? Oh, total. All right. Total. All right. Well, well, pal, you're here now. We're glad you're not selling any dope and crystal meth and <laughs> things of that nature. That. I stayed away from that. Have you ever sold pussy? No. Because that is... a what I would sell if I had one. I'm just saying. Did I sell content? It's a victimless crime, yeah. right? So they say. Is crime. it? Yes, right. It is. Yeah, but you can't ever undo that. Like, then people know you for that. 
Like, I just, I just couldn't do it. And plus, it's like, if I'm going to sleep with someone, it's like, because I want to sleep with them. Not, not right. you know, like. Not for that. money? No. Isn't that better? I make money in other ways. Like, why do I got to make it like that? You do know people I mean? recognize you from your OnlyFans? From OnlyFans? Like? I mean, like, here and there, yeah. Like, people that I grew up with obviously know that I had it. And, you know, like, it's not always a good, good look. But, like, I stopped at the end of the day and I'm yeah. not doing it anymore. Like, I... I grew up. I was like, all right, you know what? That's not the type of money I want to be making. Now I'm trying to work, which is an right. issue when you have a record. But, you know, I'm getting through it and stuff. Like, I'm doing my little home healthy thing now and stuff. Oh, that's dope. Where you take your people that are... Yeah, uh, yeah. So, Gotti, have you ever uh, purchased pussy before? No. <laughs> what? Yes. It's in the, the same... Yes. It's in... I'll, right. I'll, I'll keep it real. It's in the same... I have. It's I in have. the same... I'm going to keep it real. I have. It's in the same topic. I have. I have. What's the going rate for pussy? Forty dollars. It depends. It depends. Some it depends on what they say it on depends. Clubhouse. Sixty to eighty. Some, some, Roughly. some could be like we'll say sixty to eighty. Some for for the it depends when the hours though. Because oh, I ain't you, gonna lie, you purchasing for hours. For the hours. How long you need, honey ass supposed niggas? Supposed to be a QV. You supposed niggas, to just get niggas, in and niggas get niggas out. Want, some niggas want thirty minutes. Some niggas want an hour. So what's the longest you ever purchased some pussy for? Thirty. <laughs> 30 minutes. You didn't sound convincing. 30 minutes. You didn't sound oh, convincing. Ass, I'm not even lying. Well, if you don't get your nut in 30, it's like, time's up? No, nah, I, get, I get it. I get shit in. Oh, thank you. Take my <laughs> jacket off for this. This is getting get good. He said, I get shit in. Oh, Lord. I get shit in. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> I mean, what the fuck? Yo, I Meek, you checked out her crazy. OnlyFans? Yeah. How is it? <laughs> just talking shit. I'm just talking shit. Yeah. Oh, all right, all right. He said, I, it's, he said it too expensive. Out. Don't worry. Put it on a company card. And you know what? People get tight, too, because it's like you pay the $28, and then there's nothing really there unless you purchase the private messages, which I was charging like $100. And mm-hmm. I was doing people grind me. I would cut all it right. to like 30 seconds to a minute. Yeah. Some of them I would mute the sound on. Now, I'm you not know, against I was... OnlyFans. I knew I knew a girl who had, she was doing OnlyFans, and then um, this guy wanted to pay her uh $300. For some toes, right? No, I'm lying. He wanted to pay 150 dollars for some toes, and then um, I forgot how it happened, but I said, "Hey, do this, do that," and he ended up paying a 300 instead of 150, 300 for some toes with Whoa. peanut butter. She had to pour peanut butter on the toes. I said, "Bitch, peanut butter is two dollars. Go get that fucking peanut butter and make that's an extra 148 dollar profit." Someone wanted to pay me to stomp on like dick. Dip. With like heels on and stuff, and I never ended up doing it because I thought it was yeah. a scam. They were like, "Oh, we'll pay you big money." They were talking like thirty thousand. Like I was like, "Yeah, I've right. seen that on billions." Bo, yeah, Bo. but they were like, "Oh, oh you yeah. should call them back." The kid still hits me up to this day. I swear to God on Snapchat. And you I'm should call. Like, you should call them. Hey, what? You should call them back. That would be fire to get paid for. <laughs> Maybe if I bring like a guy, like you know, with oh, me this is a room full of guys. The fuck? Yeah, absolutely. I will send my security. Whatever. Remember one time, um, when me and my friends used to go out, like, you know, to the restaurants and stuff. See, she's trying to, she's trying to disassociate herself. Me and my friends. No, <laughs> like, we we used to go and we met this guy, and he basically was telling me about like a kink that he has. He basically, you guys are not going to hear it. Forget it. I tell us, switch. We're just here. We're here now. We're all invested. He likes to, he likes to be pegged. And so, oh my god! Oh, that's crazy. Pays money. Yeah, you could have kept I that shit to god. yourself. I said I was going to. I said tell us. I didn't know you was going to say that. That was wild. Yeah, so he, he was saying that basically he he likes he that. likes to that's be dominated crazy. by black women. He, oh, so man. he he walked up on you and told no, you. No, we all like we met. You know, like, drinking at the bar. He's paying for your drinks, and then they get in the conversation and they. <laughs> oh, that's the first crazy. Time you they met start him? telling everything. This is like this is a. Yo, I just like, you know, like, so, feel pretty like comfortable. We, yeah, what we do, like, we, we make them comfortable. They buy drinks and they drink and uh. drink and drink, and then they feel like, you know, they're one of us. They feel like one of the, like, they feel cool. You make them feel cool. What's this is bar at? So I mean, I'm sure never to go there. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna just get the, the information. No, because I don't want to see any, any. So, how much any, was he offering for said? I don't think I ever asked how much, but he pays a lot of money. He's not broke. I say that much, but he was like, you know, he likes to be dominated by black women, and he was. I'm like, well, what's the most you ever took? He was like, ah, oh, whoa, 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 flag on the play. We too much information. You don't have to go there. All right, all right, too much information. We're gonna shoot to a commercial with all that shit. That was crazy. <laughs> Yo. That was nuts. 
See, sometimes you gotta. Yep. Same way in the street shit. You gotta, you know, enough is enough. I'm done <laughs> with this. I'm done with this story. I don't know what it is. I like to. I like to hear about it. Like I love to hear these people talk about like how they become some. So these are these are powerful that? men. These are men that are like running companies. You gotta watch the show companies. Billions. And so, they're into like billions, really, yep. really all that dumb shit. Stepping and on somebody balls. Do, all you have to do is just be someone that listens. You really don't have to say much. You just have to be someone that comfortable with just, Put just being transparent with. Yeah, and, yeah, and you, crazy. you're not somebody. You're not somebody <laughs> in their direct world, right? So they don't expect that maybe you're gonna come and embarrass them or expose them to people. Like you don't know anybody I know, so they feel comfortable being honest. Yeah, and. Mm. You know, so you just you just listen, and it's crazy. I have some crazy stories. People done said some wild shit. How crazy? Because I want to go story for story. Because you girls get to hear shit that we don't hear. Like, no guy would ever feel comfortable telling us, hey, yo, I get PG'd, or like, I like women to step on my balls. You know what I'm saying? No guy would feel comfortable. Like so I love jobs. the pillow talk. What The way? Foot jobs. Foot jobs. A foot that was job, the most like awkward situation I've ever been in. Some guy was just like, "Can you put your feet around my dick and like jerk it off?" I think I had a foot job in a restaurant before. No, this wasn't in a restaurant. Like this was oh. like mid sex. Like we were in my room, and he was just like, "I want you to jerk me off with your feet." Like I was like, "You don't oh. want to fuck," and he was like, "No, I just want you." Oh, I probably, I probably job. wouldn't be. I probably wouldn't be squeezed out by that. That's crazy. I mean, I did. <laughs> Yeah. Round of applause for the truth. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. Cat Williams said this is the year of the truth. So I tried it. Yeah. And you know, like apparently, like it's not that it's bad. Not for me. It's not a lot of work. It's I not really do. a lot of work, is it? I think feet jerks are the same thing like titty fucks. I don't really. I don't think so. Really it comes way fuck. further. Pause. If it. Wait. So wait. Whoa. Whoa. Money. Mike said there's a thing where you said there's. Yeah. A, you, you have a lot of nerve endings. You gotta repeat what he's saying because they can't hear it. They're a part of your brain and a part of your feet. They're connected, basically. So a lot of people have feet fetish, and you, it's arousing for a lot of people. Yeah. So am I weird that I don't have no foot fetish? No. I don't even like feet. Do you have foot fetish, Bullis Gotti? Oh, I like I, I like getting my lie. feet. Yeah, don't lie, lie. cause Gotti, don't lie no, on this I'm show. Not, I'm not gonna lie. Don't lie. I, I like women with. With, with pretty feet, but I'm for not, what to suck the I toes? Nah, nah, I, nah. I but no, but I, what, what, you like the feet to do what? A foot job? Like what do you? I, the massage the feet really. <laughs> Gotti sucking toes. Gotti sucking toes. <laughs> nah, nah. Yeah, I did it. I did it one is, time. Is he giving sucking toes? Like yeah. that's what one he's giving. Time. One time I did. it. She had pretty feet. Yeah, one time one you sound like a, a felt like a cheating woman. <laughs> I did yeah, it one time. It, it, it was just one time. One time. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. So, so a chick. It's not that crazy. I'm Every, a Pisces. They say for a Pisces, the origin is. Oh, are you? Yeah. When? Oh, March second. I'm and the Dr. first. Have the same birthday. I'm oh, the first. Shit. That's oh, crazy. Shit. Okay, Pisces yeah. in the house. Yeah. Now. <laughs> right. So they say the origin is zone for Pisces is the feet. Really? Yes. So I love like massages. I love to go like I'll go get a foot massage, just reflexology period, just oh, on my feet. Like I like yeah. When somebody play with your feet, it's arousing. It really is. Oh, like fuck. I get really, I get really really relaxed. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> one time, I don't know how, but you know, one time I'm doing my business with this guy, and like he had me sideways, and somehow his foot how sideways like what? Okay. Up, like cuddle fucking. And yeah. somehow his foot ended up on my head, like, oh, and I was like, how are you this flexible? I saw that in a movie before, crazy. and you got to press down with the oh, foot. That yeah, was a, yeah, 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 I saw that movie before. I never I feel had, like it I've had skinny, that happen flexible. to me. <laughs> I feel like crazy. I've had a foot. Um, you got to do the press down and just to, uh, yeah, that's, that's crazy. That's a fire move. It's a move. If you could pull it off, it's a move. I'm just saying. I'm trying to think what movie I saw that in, man. It was some porno yeah, shit. I saw that yeah. shit. He was skinny as fuck, and he did the, he did a wrap around. He pressed out on the head. That was that was a move. I was like, oh shit, I gotta try that. I'm just saying. All right, so that was it. You ladies just gave us PG thirteen shit. We never got any. I didn't know about the good shit, man. This is the like Geraldo. This is I wanted. You know what I'm saying? I want this shit. Like you don't want it if you don't even want to hear the size like. 
I mean, that yeah. is too far. You're going you too far, big. Yeah, but sometimes it's not the size. It's the, like, the way they, like, you know, the motion of the ocean. Like, because I've slept with men with small penises, and, like, they were actually really good in bed. Have you ever had objects, like, per se, that fucking Azul bottle? Would do you ever take a Azul bottle in a vagina? No? Why not? Uh, grow up. I'm not going to give a Same. man the power to say that. Who they said, who they said was shoving shit in a, in a pussy somewhere? Oh my gosh! Uh, Vince McMahon had uh, wrestlers <laughs> dildos named after shit, WWE man. wrestlers. Shout to Vince I'm McMahon. Not gonna lie. He's shoving intense. Them, yeah. Shoving them all in the, the pussy. Crazy shit happened with females in their pussies. Niggas putting objects in it. It's crazy. Mm. What's the crazy crazy. object you ever put in a uh, in a chick pussy? Because I got to think about it. I don't my know. Credit card. No, you didn't. What? That ass. That sounds painful. Why would you do that? Literally, he yeah. tried to see. Did how you got swipe it. it like in the ass or yeah. like swipe? But or did you put it inside? Oh, you did the Nelly tip drill. I did the Nelly. Did but you the didn't Nelly. put it in her pussy. You just swiped it. I swiped. That's fire. I gotta try that. Did <laughs> you smell it afterwards? Yeah, no good. <laughs> no he good. swiped it between her toes. God, he's like <laughs> disgusting. Yeah, no good. <laughs> like the guy that smells the hair in Charlie's Angel. <laughs> He licked the God credit he card. Like you a, know God he did. He looked like a seat smeller. He licked the credit he card. Like he smell the seat when the girl he get up. He licked the card. He licked the you, card. You, you, you got to clean it off. When the girl get up. I Do did, you still I have did. it? Yeah. I got to wow. give me seat smeller. Is something there? Like in the seat? Like, because I never knew. If, if, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like ass whiff. Nah, it's not even. Like, if the chick pussy is wet. Yeah. Like real wet. Like I had a female where her pussy was real wet. And you can see the shit on the on the on the couch. <laughs> it's crazy. Was she a squirter? Wait. Yeah, squirter for real. Yeah. yeah. What? I'm a king, so I'm a freaky nigga, man. Don't I'm tell me that, nigga. What the fuck you looking at me for? The fuck type of Yeah. Yes. This is crazy. Oh, <laughs> Pause. Hey yo. I think the craziest thing probably that I've seen a girl put. Well, not I've seen. I didn't see it, but like on a like video porn video or something she had like the giant you ever saw the giant dildos in the in the um i saw it in a sex shop i've yeah, never seen like that this tall they're like this tall and they're like never seen it never want to see it like they're big and they like sit on it and how go don't to it town. look like well, a human body or some shit? no this is like a whale penis so like it's, it's like big right like big they, is your mic pulse no bigger it's bigger than this it's bigger it goes like this no, why would I see that, sir? Why would I even see this? Where'd you see it? It looks like an abstract, abstract statue. Let me find it. Yeah, it's crazy. I was like, yo, I don't even, yeah, I don't even like looking at shit like that, but I looked at it because I'm like, I want to see if she could really put that whole thing inside of her. That's crazy. Yeah. Well, let me ask you a question. I'm I'm curious. I'm going to be inquisitive. Pose this question: If you go to uh, your girl house, right, and we ask you as a white man if she has a big black dildo, how do you feel about that? That's Is, crazy. I'm just saying. That's crazy. Because if I see a girl, she has a big white dildo. I'm like, <laughs> yo, that's crazy. I would feel away. Like, bitch, what am I doing here? See, Meek don't Meek don't care about nothing. He just like Meek is just. No, nah, I don't want to see it. Uh, no. <laughs> I almost looked. She almost got me. <laughs> I almost looked. I want to go the rest of my life saying I've never seen the giant size dildo dick. It look like it's perfect. It looks like a, it looks like a, 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 a tree or something. It's it like, 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 it like an like abstract piece of. I'm not 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 even curious. It'd be like, and then it's like they'll get like so they they not basically they uh. basically mold like different animal penises. And they'll use that. They, so I think it's like it. it's like a whale penis or something that's like really really big. And they just sit on it and just ride. And they just go. How is that possible to, to go in? There was a girl horse too. That video that went around. Oh, around yeah, two yeah, girls, yeah. one cup time. I there was, a, there was a guy that fucked no, the horse the other that's day. That's no on great feet. Wait, what? Yeah, he, yeah he, whatever. He was just, so he got exposed by. So what happened was he was in a bar with his friends. And he left his phone at the bar, and the phone was unlocked. Some friends he and got. Somebody right. found it. Who? It, it wasn't his friends. It was some random person in the bar found the phone and went in it, you know, to find out who. And then they found the video of him, 
and basically he goes on the farm and he like pets the horse and he and it's a stallion horse, it's a man horse, and gets him aroused. Well, and duh, then, it has a dick. <laughs> gets him aroused and then gets up under him and then takes it. So the horse who, who is this person? Was in the man's. Oh, wait, yo, oh, wait, yeah. yo, oh, Jesus oh, Christ! Oh, yeah, yo, that sounds like oh, hemorrhoids hey, on top of hemorrhoids. Yeah, hey, he was yo. like taking painful. it. He was like, yeah, he was loving it. It was crazy. And did they expose his shit? Yeah, they posted. It was all over Reddit. It was all over. Who's the man? He's, they know him. I forget his name, but they they dropped his name. Face was in it. Mm-hmm. Oh, he's never coming back. <laughs> R.I.P. He got to change his face. Bet you never lose his phone again. <laughs> That's crazy. Hell, he don't need a phone. Fuck. Did he get arrested? That's Man, animal prank calls. A horse dick taker. I don't know if he got arrested, but he should get arrested. He should be arrested exposed. and thrown in the horse stable for the rest of his life. <laughs> he might like that. All right, we gonna cut the commercial. This shit is getting disgusting here. Um, it's the Facto Show. We'll be right back with some more topics. Then we out of here. God is great. Play it straight. God is smile. It don't matter if they hate. So I'm just trying to remember what it was. What was he saying? Did anybody just, read about it? Trump says a lot of things. It was he no, that's old. I know they was trying to box him out of uh, being in. I get in, grabbed by the pussy in, all the time. They don't bother me. By random men. Oh no, Man, not by, by random men. I'm just saying, but I get what, grabbed by the pussy randomly. You already said, yo, Ed, you already said so. It's I feel like it's bad. something else. You just grab by the pussy, Ed. I think everybody him. I I don't think anything's wrong with. Well, not. Something is wrong with grabbing random women by the pussy. But I don't think anything's wrong with what Donald Trump has going on. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like I, I feel like he, he had to go random with women. He's doing a Troy Ave. She's cutting me off. I I, she's doing the very thing I get accused of. Maybe if cut you off. feel it, then you won't if, do it anymore. No, nah, I'll definitely do it again because I'm a man and men don't learn lessons. Round of applause for men not learning lessons. Damn it. All right. Yeah, but I, I was saying, like, I think he's just playing up to the audience that's supporting him. You feel, you feel me? I think if it was a bunch of fucking Asian people supporting him, Listen, he would man. be doing Asian shit. Hey, let me tell you some real and shit, And fighting man. for Asian, like, whatever. My, my, my family right now, right, they beefing because you got one side of my family voting for Trump mm-hmm. and the other side like, now nah, fuck Trump. And I'm going to keep it real, man. Ain't nobody else to vote for. And that's I tell a fact, him, though. I tell him straight up, listen, man, Trump talk that shit. You got to tell him, yeah, you got to... Who the fuck get mad at Trump, man? Trump keep it real. Yeah, I don't... I just don't like the fake shit that all these... Uh, a lot of these the other Rico, politicians do. They just do fake shit. I want somebody to just be solid and just be 100. Like, I want the truth. But anyway, uh, we're back. It's the fact of the show. Uh, Queen Wolf, you got some more topics. I seen Kanye West, our guy that we fuck with over here. The fact of the show, he's been on a campaign and um, he's been having a... Half naked white woman, uh, gallivanting around the, the town. Bianca, Bianca Sensori. I don't know her name. Kanye's That's girl. Wife. Yeah, I think it's his wife now. That's Did he? Wife, does he have a prenup? Yeah. At least. I'm sure. All right. Well, let's, Listen, let's he got up. wifey outside with the with the. Kanye thong be getting on. married quick, boy. Yo, 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 Ab, he got wifey with the thong on and the motherfucking dog collars. Son. I think that's his muse. I don't know if it's <laughs> for real. Like that's just his muse. He like it got to be. Kanye is a diabolical Yo, I genius. That nigga, so I said that nigga Kim is a wild. Nigga. Yeah, she I, no, but he had a couple. He had a couple of girls after Kim. You think Kim's jealous? Absolutely, because you. Kim she, is rich, filthy. Girl, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! Hold up, Ice Cream Chucks. Here's where, here's where, here's where I'm gonna. She's rich and she was with Pete Davidson. Here's where I'm exactly. Pete Davidson's thank you. Pretty cool. He is. Pete Davidson pretty cool. cool. Listen, I heard he got a big. I would date him. You seem funny. He's from Staten Island. Yeah, he's pretty, yeah. pretty. So let me tell. Let me. Let me tell. Sometimes you, you get a woman. Let me tell by you. Just being funny. Let me tell you, women, some truth that you all know. Men care about having money. Women care about having love. I don't give a fuck. I can have all the money in the world. It means nothing. You think fucking Oprah doesn't want a nice young man that loves her for her? This is a fact, though. Mm-hmm. So Kim can have. 
Huh? You can't be a bitch. Like he has to be able to hold himself. Like I have yeah, to of course. be able to say my man will fuck you and, up. And the more money you get as a woman, the harder that becomes because of certain shit that, you know, certain pools you can't date in. I mean, you could, but you choose not to date in. Then there's certain shit that you got to deal with. Like, uh, this guy might be gay. Oh, he might be perfect, but he has a small dick. Oh, he's perfect, but he's pussy. Oh, he's perfect, but he does drugs. Like, you know what I'm saying? There's many different things. So women don't really give a fuck about having money personally for themselves. They would like the protection or security of a man that has money. But as far as Kim Kardashian, I think she's definitely jealous and feels a way. Absolutely. She loves and, him. And she can hold a solace and, oh, well, I got the kids. Uh, whatever. Woman is about who they attracted to. Straight up. Who they attracted to. If a female, you might got the bag, you might got the money, but if the nigga she like is a bum-ass nigga, and he's a pretty boy bum-ass nigga, <laughs> mm. she gonna leave you for that pretty boy bum-ass nigga. She gonna, and she gonna do all, she gonna take care of him I and do whatever she got. Man. It gotta suck as a woman to... Y'all, like, men, we could go get the girl that we want. Y'all want that bitch. And we go hunt her and get her. As women, y'all can't always do that. Y'all got to kind of take the guy who comes at you. Like, like you know, y'all may be attractive enough that, you know, out of the 10 guys that you like, maybe fucking eight, seven of them will approach you. But it might be the other three, they're shy or they're intimidated and they don't. And then, How do you feel about women that shoot the shot first? Like, if a girl hits you up. Cause some men don't like it. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off. No, hey, talk. You just the fuck. I got the platform. I talk all day. I was just curious, like, how do men feel? We we can't really hear y'all because y'all off off the joint. But let's swap out. Let let me me come in. Talk how you how you how you feel about that, me. Um, I want to say me. Really, I'm. I ain't gonna front like with certain shit. I keep it old school. I don't really um. It's cool. It's cool, but it's like whatever. You know what I'm saying? I would, I, I'd rather go hunt and get the kill myself. But when you be like, when you like, um, have money and a and a little fame or whatever, you so used to women shooting a shot that like most times a girl that you might want will shoot a shot at you anyway. So it's like fuck it. But in a in a perfect world, you'll see what you want and get the kill, and the kill will be met with little resistance. That'd be perfect, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, just give me, like, a little, like, a little flirt. Look at me or whatever. All right, then let me come get my, That's bitch, come here. Let me grab you, by the, grab you by the pussy or something. You feel me? Some Donald Trump shit. But to come over and be like, hey, let me get you. Number. Whoa, whoa, bitch. This is a setup. The fuck? Who you with? Let me search you. You know what I'm saying? I don't like that shit. I ain't with that. Not me. The slide in the DM game is crazy, though. I think that's, that's a little crazy, different. That's crazy, but that's like the, that's like for, like, the new generation. If you ask, ask me... Yeah, that's what Whatever, she's doing. Uh, she's asking you. You're a guy on. and you have the microphone. See, so you're see, being asked. Nigga, sir. I have it still on the jokes. I'm just see, saying. Whatever, cause like, but whatever. Look, what I'm saying was. Cause like. <laughs> I mean, look. <laughs> look, like back in the day, it was like, listen, female want me, like, when you got to, you just see a female, when you see a female, I'm like, that's your opportunity. Nowadays, it's like, yo, we got every girl on every website, every media is like, oh, yo, yo, my, what's your name? Ah, such such blah, blah, whatever. It's different now. It's a whole lot different now. He said all I have to say is different now. Meek, you're way better at DJing than you are at speak. Because you said a lot to just say it's different now. You know what I'm you saying? Did you shoot your shot? Like, if you wanted to. I just, um, shot, I just shot my shot. Like and I, I think I made my three-pointer. You did? did? Not, you got the Jimmy? Who you shot your shot at? Of course I got the Jimmy, of course. You got the Jimmy? What does that mean? <laughs> well, how, how you oh, Jimmy. Oh. You do it? <laughs> um, I've, I I'm can naturally flirt. I don't, so I probably wouldn't shoot my shot. So you be flirting with I would. What's the idea of flirting? Like, yeah, yeah I, you, I will let you know that I'm interested, and I would prefer for you to receive the message and then approach me. How does that look? Letting God know you're interested. Like, what is that? What would that look like? I'm just I'm not say you're out at a restaurant. Flirting. I don't like. I don't know the definition of like I'm flirting. Ask certain questions. No, like you on your you're you're sitting laugh, down and smile. the guy's walking, but at that point you're already close. But how do you a guy even get in that position? You know what I'm saying? At that to to laugh and ask somebody a question, you're already close. Something's already happened to get you to that position. I'm saying like if you if a woman's sitting down with her friends, there's three of y'all sitting at a table and the guy's walking to the bathroom and you're passing by, how does a woman, asking both of y'all, flirt to let that guy that's looking at you know that he's attracted? 
Because I don't want to get mixed signals. Like, me approaching me. No, I'm, so so y'all yeah, sitting like, at a table. Yeah, we had fucking uh, towels. So what yeah, I've done, normally, yeah, what I've done normally, before, like a towel. I can tell you what I've done before. Um, like a guy might be like, no, I, no, absolutely not. Listen. So one time I I sent the drink over. And you sent a drink over? Yeah. That's I crazy. I sent a drink over. That's crazy. I never heard of that. He sent one back. That's wild. And I would have sent the whole bottle. That's fucking tricking, actually. No, Round of applause Yo, for the big sent trick. The whole bottle. Clean sent trick. Over. Round of applause. Back. I've I had many drinks sent to whatever, me, and I was like, oh. Uh, just get him another one. And then he'll say, well, whatever she's having, I'm going to buy the drink back. That's not, and that's not flirting. That's aggressive. It's not aggressive. Sending a drink? Yeah, that's like coming not, up to you saying what's up. It's not aggressive. It's not aggressive. It, 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 it could literally just be... That's the... It could literally be... That's It could literally just be nothing. We could, he could just come over and say, you know, well, thank you for the as drink. A guy, have a good As night. a guy, I'm going to take that as an act of war. That's like coming up to me and saying, yo, let me get your number. Sending a drink? That's everything. That's an invitation, yo. That's what it is. I probably wouldn't even turn around. I'm going to tell, tell, tell you this. send me a drink, I'm going to send her a bottle. As a girl... As a girl, he said you send a bottle. Send a bottle. Send me a drink accomplished. You'll be broken a month. <laughs> whatever. Mission accomplished. You, 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 you send bottles to everybody? Thanks. No. Mission accomplished. Right. If, if a girl Thanks send me a drink, I know what I'm doing. Thanks for the bottle. I'm going to fuck my like, man while I'm says, drunk. Right, look, you know what? Send her and, and her friends a whole bottle of champagne. I, I Mission think. Mission accomplished. That's, that's There you go. And that's how you get the drugs. I think a girl sending you a drink is more aggressive, right? And then maybe I'll speak from a point of a person that gets it all the time. A girl sending me a drink outside, physically at a restaurant, is more aggressive than a girl putting heart eyes in a DM. Well, of course, because it's in it's in person. All right, so I'm I'm right. You guys feel away. Okay. It's in person. So so then, like I said, it's an aggressive act. That's not a flirt. A flirt is a flirt. Sending a drink. This effect, you know how I deal with fact. Send a drink is not a flirt. That's an open invitation for pussy. Round of applause. I, I disagree. What? That's why I bitches disagree. get grabbed by the pussy for sending drinks. <laughs> that's a trump. Well, you think if, because no, you I got disagree. a drink, yeah, that's an invitation to grab me send, by the pussy? If you send somebody a drink and they walk over and grab you and that, yo, thanks for that drink, girl. That shit was fire. What you going? No, don't touch me. <laughs> No, Whoa, why I'm, would they say I'm that? Confused. I don't think he's you said coming mixed signals. and just walking up and grabbing you by the pussy. I think he's gonna say, you know. They I think. How about or... this? Perfect, perfect point. A guy is more likely. A guy is less likely to get a drink sent to him than a girl is more likely to get her pussy or her ass grabbed. This is a fact. Out of this room full of men, right? Ninety-seven percent. Y'all have probably 90, got your ass grabbed more times in life than we've gotten correct. drinks sent to us. Not this is a fact. You that's are why, an aggressive act. But Round of applause move, for me with the that's facts. That's why the move is almost it's almost fail-proof. Like because it's an open invitation for pussy. It's not a. Flirt. It's not an open invitation for pussy. A flirt I mean, is like I'm already hey, letting you know what time I'm on, and however you approach me at that point is what's going to determine. Yo, Av, let me. It's really going to determine. What time are you it's really going to determine Av, what level I deal with you. Send on. a man a drink. What time are you on? Like, come here. How many I females sent you a drink? I'm interested. What's up? How many females sent you a drink, Av? Like drinks, like, I don't like, know. Like I, don't if know I freestyle, like, I'd be like ten. I've had girls send bottles in the club, but that'd be like fans enough. of music and like drinks at a okay, restaurant, no. but Intimate not a lot. That shit like is here. rare. A girl sending you a drink when you out kicking it with your niggas. That's one percent. And then that's one percent. It might be out something slick. Like, what are you trying to outdo me? Like what? Do you like? It's just no. it sparks the conversation. No, Queen Wolf. Yeah. Look, Queen Wolf. Let's be real. Listen, I put my Mac. Queen Wolf. How do you? How do you flirt? If I don't know the person, I'm like, well, yeah, I duh. I, I mean, like, I'm just saying like, the first I, meet. No, like I look, you know, like I'll walk past them, like to see if they say something. And like, I, I when you wait, like when you walk past them, the when you, move, when you walk past them, are you looking or are you yeah, no, doing I'll, the girl shit where you try to act like you don't see them? No, I'll flirtatiously look like, you know, maybe I'll like brush like my finger, you know, like just like kind of make it like I'm interested like, I fucked them a little bit, you know, like, from across the room. I feel like that's bit. more of an invitation to be grabbed what? by the pussy. No, it's not. Because that, that's so. open to interpretation. Like, you might walk past a guy and he might just... Russian, give it, walk, fuck me eyes. Girls walk past me and I might just be <laughs> like, just keep it a hey, what's like, up? And keep it, comes, it light. When it comes to females being out, they go out, they dress sexy, they expect a nigga to buy them a drink. Us, pe us niggas, we don't... Oh, hey, a female go by... That's one in a fucking paint... It's Most very, it's why, very rare. That's why my swag is on another me. level. What can I what? say? I think what? girls buy your drinks all the time. You what? reverse what? You the roles. You can never have a, a so girl when, buy a guy a drink. So when you when when you walk past and do the flirting and stuff, right? Like like then what? 
if they don't like try to if they don't catch it first, if they don't initiate it they don't catch the talking. pussy you're throwing no if, yeah if they right, don't okay. end up talking to me first i won't i won't talk. maybe if like i really want it i'll go up to them and be like you know like hi what's up like my name's Alyssa. like yeah you know but i'm so bad at it i'm not good at like trying to get with yeah, i can't the, do that dms and stuff so like, you can I'm just terrible. send a drink crazy i, I can't i can't do that, do that. at I least she's not 20 dollars out off the rip have so if some if a female buys you a drink, ninety nine percent of the time they're gonna send man, another drink. As a man, does that automatically means it's a fuck? Because to me, yeah, I, I believe I'm, it is. If a girl f- buy you a drink, it's a it's, fuck. It's, it's, it's all right. set up. It's a fuck or a setup, right? Yeah. And then off the rip, I'm thinking, bitch, you, you out here just buying mad niggas drinks. That no, ain't the norm. Exactly. Like, so I'm, yeah, what's in this drink? Bill Cosby is a setup. Be real, no, because I'm not like just bringing you a drink. I'm sending the waiter. The to, waiter to might have be in on it. You, you haven't want. you seen uh, the movie with uh, J Lo no, and you, Cardi you, B? You haven't bought a, a, what's the movie? A nigga drink, not, there's never been a time. And then when if I buy strippers. you a drink, if I buy you a drink and you buy me Don't one, then I broke drink. even. It's they not. It's not a loss. So a nigga buy you a drink, you gonna buy a nigga drink back? More times, like I said, 99 percent of the times you send a drink, they're gonna send one back. They're going to what? Because it's a it's a pride thing. You're not gonna you're not gonna upstate That's and a send me a drink and you're a female. That's a fact. Because if no, I have to drink, return the favor. I'm it's psychological. Right. It's it's fun. It's, it's different. Girls do shit for girls. It, it's psychological. They're gonna they're always gonna return the favor. Listen, Even if they and then they'll get up and they're gonna say thank you. So if if now they're open and if they're available, then they're gonna continue the conversation. Us if they're man can send you. A I've girl had girls not, send me drinks and I just baby, oh, appreciate not, it, and I don't send a drink. Man back. Just send a girl you. a drink because we're looking at her, but look, she she don't, she don't look happy. Maybe she's having a bad day. Oh, hey, let's cheer her up. Oh, hey, let me make her happy. A female, big trick. Hey, hey, y'all are some <laughs> big tricks in here today. That's, that's different. A that's female, different. A female sent me the drink automatically. Hey, right, she's trying to fuck. It doesn't matter. She wants to fuck. No. I could send it as many drinks back. The sometimes, first drink you send me. Sometimes I like the thrill of the chase. I like to know that I can get you, and I'm cool with that. I'm the same. Wolf. Like, you don't agree with that? And Wolf. Once yeah. I get it, I'm like, all right, I'm done. What? Y'all look like men then. No, you can't know, talk to her. I think like a man. Once I know that I could get you, like I, more times than not, it's the thrill of the chase. I'm good. Like, once I know I could get your number, you come over here, you say thank you, you want to talk to me and get to know me, I'll be like, all right, it's over. Like I'm good. Yeah. I'm, I'm boo, as they would say. And you're never going to get back to her. Huh? You're never gonna you're never gonna get back to them. Probably, more more likely than not. It's not no. a problem. Is it yes or no? Wolf. No. Especially if they're easy. Oh, it's like nah. Do you believe? I like being. Have do you believe bullshit? It never it never lasts. When you meet somebody, Yo, you meet Wolf, somebody in restaurants. Bullshit. You meet somebody oh. in clubs. You meet somebody in bars. Those are not long term relationships. Those are more so. It's like, one night stands. Those are more so like in the moment in the moment situation. So like I said, more times than not, it's the thrill of the chase. I don't care to. Right. You want it for I'm the not moment. trying to meet the love of my life in the restaurant. I'm just trying to have a good time. It's and the same shit as you wanna, being married. And I just want to know that I still I go got out, it. I meet. I'm. I'm going to meet this perfect guy. And, oh shit. You know what? Hey, let me sleep on one time, but I'm not going to tell my my husband because I don't want to feel ashamed of myself. I'm not a sleep. Same sleep. Like no, I'm not a sleep like, one not. time. I'm not. I'm not they saying like you are, but in like the supermarket or something. Like when I'm out. I like think that's a nice a casual places. place to meet somebody. Like I a feel supermarket. Like that's more, I supermarket has a family. <clears throat> no, Is they they know? actually are responsible when they're cooking and not ordering fucking oh. Uber Eats all the time. I look at it like that. Family. I used to like go to Barnes and Nobles and see like what kind of guys are in there. Like sometimes, you know. I think that's a good place to meet somebody. Smart, like at least better in the club. That's a fact, though. Better in the club. I, I wouldn't buy any books. <laughs> I mean, who, who buys books at Barnes and Noble? What are you, a nerd? You know what I'm saying? I was a nerd at one point in life. Uh, hence bad. the glasses on your head that you right, don't so pull down. So what made you not become a nerd and just be like a whole freak? Like, fuck it, whatever. A freak or like just a bad kid like as a kid? Yeah, a bad freak. A bad kid's a freak, so. I got Whoa, that that way, that. Ew, that's not a bad kid is not necessarily a freak. Um, you talking about a bad kid is a freak? If you date a girl that... I was a bad kid. I'm not a let freak. Me, let me, bad let me, kids are freaks, though. Oh, yeah, girls? Right. Let me ask you a question. If you... I know some bad girls. They listen, were too ugly to be freaks. What I mean by that the is that... Ones are the listen. Uh, nobody was fucking them. Yeah, you could... You could take a girl's virginity, wife them for set four or five years, and then that whole six year, you fuck up, and all of a sudden, she's a... Whatever. I'm off this show. Meek is drunk. 
Meek has Meek Meek you lit Meek I've seen you, you. Meek time. has He has a DC I've seen his face before In, go in DC And I've seen his face In Las Vegas Meek is lit Put the camera on him Please Leaf He's lit like a bick Right now He's lit like a bick Listen And look, look my, my Why friends friends talk? Friends He can't even turn up. Yes. My friends and family Can you smell <laughs> What the rock is cooking No listen my It's getting devilish This is when They call me in Vegas Cut it out I don't want to bring And fucking puts the story on me Listen you bring me out of Vegas Seen this guy since last I've been, night. I, I've been crazy in Vegas, but listen. Yeah, this I'm, I'm I not see. drunk. I'm, I'm just acting realistic shit because I dealt with a realistic baby mother who went through a fucking situation I've been talking about. A whole phase. Exactly. What? A baby mother went through a whole phase while you was with her before. Don't what me? This is Mr. crazy. Mr. I don't got a whole baby listen, mother. Hey, tell like, you what you Hey, you say. Me. Listen, I'm telling Wait. you. This is why I'm asking questions because I want to know. Was the whole phase before you or after you? Or during you? It was during. <sighs> so, whatever. It is what it is. This is outrageous. You don't gonna fucking be sorry. Y'all hear this shit? That's crazy. Listen, it is Leaf, what it is. Leaf, where's my camera? Did get back at it? I need to show me walking off. Listen, I'm that guy. This is crazy. It's not crazy. Listen, all right, it's Wait, crazy. Wait, with now. you? Like, she was yeah, freaky she went, with you. Oh, so you're not saying she was somebody? sleeping with other people. Listen, she went through a whole phase. And, listen, look. I'm a guy, so it's like going through the whole phase while she with you. No, look, um, I'm a guy. Is, I cheated, whatever, whatever, and like, I mean, like that's no grounds. To get back. That's no grounds so to go through a whole like, phase right, of being a whore. Realistically, I'm like, alright, whatever, like, cool. You make me numb. I'm not gonna sit there. And I'm not fighting no nigga over a bitch. I'm not fighting. I'm going to move on. I'm going to live Who's a happy gonna life. Fight the nigga. Listen, my first experience, I knocked the nigga out, and. Whatever. <laughs> they were still fucking around. It is what it is, but you're a woman. Never again, man. Nah, I'm not a woman because that, that was no, that I'm was my first. Exp- oh no, that was like my first experience. Yeah, Wolfie, so it's like, damn, like, oh shit, you cheating on me with this nigga? I, I felt like me as a man, I had something to prove. I had so a, you, so you punched the nigga in the face, but it was your girl that about, gave right. the pussy up. You see, but me, I'm not looking at. I'm a hood nigga. I'm not looking at. Oh shit, like. Yo, you talk to my bitch, ah, whatever, 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 whatever. But then y'all get then y'all get mad at women when they do was, the same thing. I was when they immature, attack the Wolfie. other woman. I was immature. I was I was immature. I wasn't You feel me? But now I was like moving forward. If it, like even after the after that hey, fact, I'm like Hey yo, but me. I, let me let me ask you though, bro. Like that that's kind of crazy though, bro. I mean, he is. said, "Let me ask you. That's kind of crazy. It that's kind of like, crazy, about, though, bro. Listen, I don't care about. Cheat, listen, look. Let's just keep the buck. I'm gonna speak as a man, like nigga. You're not telling me it's not one man who ever got jealous over another nigga doing X, Y, and Z, especially when it's a secret and you don't yeah. know about it. All right, cool, whatever. Yeah, I could feel like a sucker for that day. Just nigga, giving not, Mario whinings. I don't want to know if you, you know, yeah. playing me. Keep it on the low." Nah, I mean, nigga, once you cheat on me, it's over. We're gonna get you we're gonna get you some therapy. I do I have a degree in psychology, Meek. So we're gonna talk after this episode because yeah, I think well, you need yeah. some intervention. But um yeah. Troy Ave has walked off the show. He couldn't take any more yeah. of uh Meek's uh simping. So we're gonna wrap you gotta this go up. Back to work. We're yeah. gonna wrap this up, you y'all. Um, you know, to the chat niggas, real ones, chat queens, yeah. shout out to you guys. Comment and let us know what we should do with Meek because He's going through it, and I'm just trying to figure out how I'm supposed to handle this. Um, I need some help. I need some comments. And the only thing I would say to you is never take, you know, criticism from anybody that you won't take advice from. Did I say it right? And, <laughs> yeah. and you know. Yeah, yeah the and, whole and, phase and is you, crazy. Oh, 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 you walked off right. You don't count. Don't let your bitch go through a whole phase. He ain't never lie. While she with you. I never heard yeah. that. Whole phases. Do y'all go through whole phases in your relationship? That's We're going to talk about that on the next episode, Wolfie. Uh, on the oh. next episode. The next episode. We're going to check on me. Hopefully by next week, no. he, he got it together because I don't know. The whole phase But you crazy. got anything to say, Gotti, before we get out of here? Um, I'm going to just say this, man. Me, hold your head, bro. And um, that whole phase shit is crazy. I, I'm going to just keep it real. The whole phase, like, wifey going through the whole phase is crazy, though. That's kind of crazy. You got anything to say? Uh, you want to say anything to me? Give him some kind words of encouragement? As a woman? Who, um... I hope you find a better woman. Yeah. I really do. Yeah. I, heal from it. And yeah. then, you know. 
All right. God bless. All right, yeah, Meek. You got you got anything? Any closing words before we send you to therapy? Yeah. Um, I'm about to go to therapy for like sixty days. Um, if you su- if you feel something inside your gut, just go with it. Unless it's to unless it's to kill the bitch, because then yeah. you're gonna unless go to jail. unless unless it's, uh, unless it's, it's a killer bitch. But unless other than that, listen, different. whatever's inside your gut, if it's listen, if it's pure, yeah, listen. Amen. Go with it. Amen. This go is this Amen. is the this is pause. Pause. I'm going through shit right now. Amen. I'm going. Amen. I'm going through. I'm going through, I'm going through hollers moments right now. Somebody give me a if camera. If I feel I'm something inside my gut, right I'm going with it. So, I'm going through right now. Speaking yeah. for my feelings. Yeah, he needs some call hey, Thomas uh, right uh, now. On, it, I can't talk to Av because Av's going to joke on me. So it's like, know what I mean? He's he's not going to give me fucking great advice. So yo, Meek, it's going to be okay. Don't worry about it. You know what I mean? Av is going to take me to a fucking club and. You're going you're gonna meet yeah, all these fucking yeah. moms. Hey, Lee, put the kid, hey listen, yeah. it's a facto show. It's a facto show. I don't know. What it's a facto show, man. We out of here because this is getting crazy. Out of here. Out of here. See y'all next week. Yes, God sir. bless. Yes, sir.